Ladies and gentlemen, what we are looking at right now is the end of bad governance protest, which is currently going on in some parts of Nigeria, especially in Lagos and in the north. Okay, so what you are looking at now is the northern version of that very protest. <laughs> okay, and you can see that these youths are flying Russian flag. They have decided to take up Russian flag. And you can read meaning into this very thing. Okay, it simply means that someone is behind them. Someone has sent them to fly that Russian flag. And what it simply means is that they have realized but they have come to the realization that Nigeria is the problem. Nigeria is the problem. Okay? Uh, Tinubu's government, like I, I always say it, <laughs> Tinubu's government is not the problem. Nigeria has a, fundament, a fundamental problem, a foundational deficiency. Nigeria has a problem, a fundamental problem. And that is the reason why we are seeing all these things we are seeing. That is the reason why there is no electricity. That is the reason why there is no running water. That is the reason why our, our hospitals, that is the reason why our roads are, are very bad. That is the reason why we are having politicians who, do, who don't care about <laughs> the masses. Because what they care about is the money they are going to steal. Nobody loves Nigeria. Like I, I always say that Nigeria is an orphan. Nigeria is like an orphan. Nobody loves Nigeria. Nobody owns Nigeria. Everybody is looking for a way to steal something and go back to his uh, immediate family. <laughs> Nobody loves Nigeria. Nobody wants to pay prices. Nobody wants to uh, make sacrifices because that law for a country does not exist in Nigerians because Nigeria is not a product of Nigerians. Nigeria is a product of the colonial masters. Nigeria is a product of the slave masters. And those of you who go out and say that Nigeria is our heritage, <laughs> Nigeria is not your heritage. And if you agree or if you claim that Nigeria is your heritage, it means that you are accepting that you are a slave. So Nigeria is what you inherited from your slave master. That's what it simply means. But let us talk about the, the Northern youth who are flying the Russian flag. The question should be, why Russian flag? It simply means that they are inviting Russia to come and take over the North. They are paying allegiance or they are pledging allegiance, loyalty to Russia. They are simply inviting Russia just the way Niger and other West African countries who are being, uh, being ruled by the military now. The way they, they invited Russia to come, they invited Russia to come and take over their country. That is the way this northern use and those who are backing them, they are inviting Russia to come and take to come and take the north. Tell us what you think in the comment section and don't forget to share this video. Don't forget also to follow us on this page because we'll be bringing you interesting videos every day. Thank you for watching.